Okay, I'm heading into LNL Fleetik in Adamsburg. We're just outside of Pittsburgh. And uh, Mark's off to get a motorcycle part, and I'm going to go shopping. So I definitely want to circle back around to the first booth, but someone was in there. My first time here. Hopefully they got really good stuff. Stuff to buy. Now I'm going to try to stay ahead of the music, but we'll see how that works. I wanted to come in here, see the old tchotchkes. I see a lot of bears. Some chickens. It's an elephant planter for 18. That's cute. This booth is tight, but I'm gonna squeeze in here. Would that be a pug? Seven dollars. Aw, kitty on his back for four. There's an alligator. Six, six, I um, would guess. Ashtray. So look at this cast iron, Uncle Sam. Iron figurine, 650. You hardly ever see. Vintage um, Independence Day stuff or patriotic. This is really cool. Five dollars for the holiday lights, mini refills. Look how little that box is. You got some toys, some coasters, bear coasters, six fifty. I think I am going to get this. Mini mini minis. I see, I see. Ooh, look, they have scrabble towels. Ten fifty. That's cool. You can usually find scrabble at your cells, but they're great for making uh, words up and um, you know, for assemblages. Hmm, that's tempting. Then I see some planters over here. The Shawnee Duck is 18. And this bobble is eight. And is he oh he's a planter too. Look at that. That's cool. Now I'm right up near the front where you the cashier. It's just a little bit noisy over here, but oh lucky. This is 14 Lamb Planter. Oh, that's cute. Oh. I don't need it though for 14. Mm. I'll think about it. It's right near the cashier, so I'm not too worried. I walked in the spring here. A lot of newer stuff, but I do see a couple of vintage pieces. How much is this? He is. The little teeny tiny tag $5.99 he's kind of cute isn't he I don't know if he's a gnome so he's more like one of the seven dwarfs no puppy planner for $3.50 that's not bad Hmm, I wouldn't say, I don't know if it's Japan old, but probably Taiwan, would be my guess. What is this little thing down here? It's almost like a little sewing box, $5. Definitely newer, but I like it. Let me sneak in here. So lots of bunnies. Oh, how much is he? Let's see, he is. Oh, these tiny tags. $4.25. Oh, that is cute, cute, cute. Originally $1.50. I would get him to make an assemblage piece. I think that would be a cute summery one. And I just got that bottle brush tree. But that would go in there really well. So I think I'm going to get that. Some gold bunnies, some littles, fairies. 
There's just so much in here. My eye darts around from spot to spot. Let me put this in my cart. I'm going to look at these. Closer look at these little um, figures. I think they're very new and resin. Taking a closer look at these. Dollar so, twenty-five. They are like out of um, like the fairy garden stuff. Might be my guess. The frog's cute. He's two seventy-five. There's some tchotchkes down there. I think that's it. There's a little bus for 375. Don't like him as much though. It's 1250. Our uh, goat <laughs> would be my guess. Wow, you hardly ever see goats. Very brown, but I like them. But I think I'm going to get them. Okay, I have a set of these. Actually, a pair on eBay. They only want 28 for theirs. Mine match. And then this set is 28 as well. But I see cards. I see go, go, go. Mmm. And I see busy bees. No, oh, let me look at the uh, graphics real quick. Not quite as cute as I was hoping. This is the front of the busy bee. That is the back. This is the front of the go, go, go. And that's the back. I was hoping for like more um, cutesy uh, animals and stuff. So I'm going to put those back in. And I'm not going to get them. But that's a good deal. $4. Turn around and see all these planters and look at this cutie. Oh, please don't be expensive. Ah, oh, 28. Yeah. I don't blame them. That's a good price. Not really interested in any of the other ones. I see them all the time. It's a cat for 12. She's darling. She's 20, the Dutch girl. So I'm very much on the fence about getting this plant. Uh, it's a candle holder. 350 is Japan. Now there's a sticker that says apple scented. It does not smell like an apple anymore. But I was thinking for like uh, the summer holidays, the patriotic um, pops of color. So that would be perfect on its own or put a bottle brush tree in there, put some uh, mercury beads on it and call it like very patriotic, you know? So for 350, I think I'm going to get it. Uh, on the fence though, but um, uh, it's going to my cart, going to my cart. I'll show you what else they got over here, Dalmatians. The mug is Otagari and it is three dollars. The little Dalmatian that's bisque, <laughs> three fifty. I don't mean to knock bisque around, but it's truly not my favorite. Sometimes it can be really a pain in the rear end to clean, and um, I just never developed that love for it. Although some things are just beautiful in bisque. I like this little chipmunk puzzle. Two fifty. That's not bad. Um, don't really see anything else. I kind of like how this booth is color coded. And then there's some utensils. But now I think I'm going to head upstairs and see what they got up there. Heading upstairs. See what's up here. I see the music followed me. Look at these little eye mugs. I love grandpa. I love grandmother. Three fifty each. They're sweet. I don't know how well they would sell, but they're sweet. It's a little teddy. Dollar twenty-five. And then I love how they took these buttons and made an arrangement with them. That's really cute. 
couple planters. I'm not really into the booties. I have a couple of the booty planters. Wow, soapstone, $75. That's intricate. My mother-in-law actually used to uh, carve soapstone. She's made a couple things, but she's gotten away from it now. She's in her 80s. So now she makes quilts. I like these. I need three. supposed to be like that okay so I'm gonna put this back it is a Capo de Monte it is stamped with Italy but I don't think they sell for all that great so I'm gonna put that back here on the shelf they got some really good prices which is this paperweight five it's a yeah it's a transfer now there's someone next to me in case you hear talking she's restocking her booth i love it but you know it's funny how you love something i was thinking about getting this it is britain bone china for three ballerina she's in really good shape won't be a lot in profit, so I don't know. I guess all one sold for 15, so maybe I'll just put that back too. Okay, moving on. So I see these kitties back here, these kitty cats, 250 except for one. Yeah, so it'd be $5 for the pair. They are adorable. And then this set of kitty cats, it's 250 Anybody call for Superman? If so, he's $55. I like the ribbons. Oh, what is that back there? Uh, I think it's um, like a tool ribbon. Oh, I like the little tooth, first tooth thing. The little tooths are $6. That's sweet. See this puppy dog planter down here for 30. Oh, what is this? What is this? Uh, a little pixie looking thing. Price tags on the back side for 15. Royal Sealy Japan elf planter. 15 though. Mm, that's hard to justify. Something does not look right with him. Why is his legs open like that? $29.99. Then some compote dishes and some ashtrays. $9.99 for the blue, $4.99 for the amber. Blendo sets $49.99. I've seen this moon cookie jar auction before. $49. That is so whimsical. A little crack up there, but. Nothing terribly bad. That left in candy dishes, all sparklies five. Well, it's hard to resist with the sparkle on it. You go back here and see what's in this little corner. That is four for the mama and baby piggies. I like the gourd bunny, 30. I have a couple of these, but they're, um, Halloween and Christmas related. Oh, those are plastic. This year, we have plans. And they tend to make some of the back. Yeah. Very strange in the window. Boy, I got myself all lost in here. I'm like, wait, is that the way down? No. Is it blocked by a cart? So I got to go over there, too. Look at this guy. He is uh, 10 bucks. Goofy. Somebody likes their puppy dogs. And their elephants. Eee, I don't know. Mouse and kitties for eight. 
That just doesn't look quite right. 17 for that one. So nothing's really like smacked me in the face so far saying you have to have to get it. But I've gotten a couple of things so far. So a poly pocket for $10. Back in this corner of don't know where I'm at. I'm looking to see Mark's truck. He's not back yet. But this cat is Mark Japan and it's $4. I don't know if I should get it or not. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know anymore. Okay, I got me all lost. I'm back to where I think I should be. I'm gonna check it out over here. Yeah. Wait. Wait a second. I have been here. Oh my goodness. It's a maze. Alright, let me get away from the music. Okay, showing you my last booth before I go check out. Yeah, this is like the same booth as downstairs that was all springy. So what those are for 75 probably each for the block. 450 for that bunny. The blocked bunnies. I just wanted to point out I love these little sheep. I don't know where she got them from, but they're really neat. They're glass. Lots of little animals. I know those came from Target. There's a little spun chick that is $275. And I just wanted to show you it real quick because I am getting ready to head downstairs and pay so we can get back on the road. Did I already say that Mark's back? Look, there's a little elephant, or elephant, a little cow, that's ceramic. These I looked at, they're $275 a piece. Very cute. And uh, just little like Hello Kitties and stuff like that. No candy dish for eight. So I'll just step back here and show you what it looks like because it just screams like, come in, it's spring. Maybe E-I-E-I-O, I'm not sure. I figured I'd take a moment to show you what I got before I head downstairs. Oh, shoot. I had to get my glasses out so I could see. So I'm getting that for $3.50, the little apple. The Uncle Sam, he's $6.50. This little poodle planter or cocker spaniel. It is $4.25. And then I did find this, found this piece of amethyst glass for $3. So um, that's it. I'm, I'm out of here.